Hello and good day. I'd like to welcome you to 914 Williams Alley in Old Town Key West. My name is John Farce. I'm a realtor with Keller Williams here in Key West. And I'd like to uh, invite you to join me here at uh, 914 Williams Alley, a 100% newly constructed property. So uh, let's go inside and take a look. 914 Williams Alley is entirely new construction. The notice of occupancy was issued in December 2019. I have all the drawings, all the permits, and multiple photographs from the one year build out. The property sits eight feet above base flood elevation. There is an elevation certificate on file with the state and I have a copy. Quality control of the construction was assured in two ways. First, all building material was sourced from the number one lumber company in town, that being Manly DeBoer. Second, every piece of lumber was hand selected by the builders in order to ensure that each, each piece was straight and true. The already strict building code of Monroe County was further enhanced by the extensive use of metal strappings from the 5000 PSI pads to the galvanized aluminum sheet metal roofing. The net result when you add in the hardy board siding is an exceptionally rugged, low maintenance and very sturdy building. Let's go on up to the porch for a second and take a look. So again, the outside of the house is all hardy board, PVC around the window frames, and the windows also have a UV rating. Additionally, the shutters are actually functional, so you have all the best mitigation attributes available for both uh, windstorm and flood insurance. The property here now is facing to the west, and just off this direction, not even uh, 10 minutes by uh, bike or walk, are the three best waterfront parks in Key West the Truman Waterfront Park, the Key West Amphitheater, and the Fort Zachary Taylor Florida State Park. The three best places in town to wander around and see the greenery of Key West. So let's go inside and, uh, and take a look and, uh, and we'll see all the uh, specialized uh, hardwoods that we have inside this house here. The inside of 914 Williams Alley is a beautiful mix of exotic hardwoods. Brazilian hardwood floors on both the first and second floor, Sapodilla hardwood, antique 200 year old Dade County pine, Brazilian cherry, and on the second floor, New England knotty pine. The result is a beautiful mix of artisan hardwoods. The all electric kitchen leads directly to the dining room and overlooks the living room. The centerpiece of the living room is a 13 foot wide doorway that leads to the outdoor deck and pool area. The accordion glass door for the doorway is storm and UV rated and can be easily operated with just two hands. An all electric kitchen deep aluminum undermounted sink, downdraft cooktop, and the incredible bar top here is the same sapodilla that was made or that was used to make the uh, staircase. And again, the doorway outside, the front door, the front wall is all a Brazilian cherry. Microwave on top of oven, Dade County Pine cabinetry, stainless steel refrigerator. The three doors here from right to left, on the far right is the pantry. In the middle is the 40 gallon water heater and uh, downstairs air handler. And to the left is a half bathroom. All of the cabinetry is quarter sawn, antique Dade County pine, and all of the handles are uh, calorie shells of some particular sort.
The countertop is Brazilian blue quartz. The bar top is the reclaimed sapodilla tree that had fallen two years ago in a storm and had been hand cut and in this case polished into a fabulous sheen. Also you can see the, uh, the natural edge has been retained on both this side and on the other side. Underneath where all the uh, bar stools are is also a considerable amount of uh, cabinetry for your larger pots and pans and these doors like the rest of the cabinetry all have the soft close type of closing process. The staircase is constructed of a salvaged sapodilla tree that fell during a storm a few years ago. All of the posts, planking as you see here, and all of the steps are constructed out of this single sapodilla tree. This first master bedroom sits at the top of the staircase and faces east. It has its own private bathroom and barn door style walk-in closet. In the corner, a double glass doorway that leads outside to your own private Romeo and Juliet style balcony. Both second floor bedrooms have ceilings comprised of New England knotty pine and overhead trusses. These trusses are not just decorative, they are part of the structural integrity of the property. Moving now to your private balcony from which you can look over the parking area below and the deck and pool area. And now outdoors. As I said before, the exterior is all hardy board and the window frames are all PVC. Again, all the windows are uh, windstorm and UV rated and downstairs here also with screens. The deck is an AZEC deck built around this fabulous 150 year old sapodilla tree. Remember the balcony I mentioned off the second floor master bedroom? There you are right there. Looking down over the AZEC deck and the 10 by 11 heated pool. The south and west sides of the property are lined with 14 foot tall bamboo. And in your parking area, we have a charging station for your electric car or golf cart. Your 10 foot by 11 foot heated pool, a long life, low maintenance exterior, and a large, quiet, shaded songbird filled deck to optimize your outdoor indoor living experience. All right again this is 914 Williams Alley Old Town Key West. My name is John Pars. Thank you very much for coming by. Uh, it's a beautiful sunny day down here today. Hopefully the same up in your area and if it's not come on down here and enjoy some of our uh, Key West sunshine. Again thank you very much and take care out there.